Whoa. Is this what drugs are like? I think the game box was laced with LSD or something. Because I am tripping balls right now, dude. I may also be going deaf because of this music. Please make it stop. This is Jeremy McGrath Supercross World, the pinnacle of sport-themed video games. FIFA, Madden, NBA 2K, get that shit out of here. I want my daily fix of Jeremy McGrath. I don't even know where to begin with this one. So let's begin here, turning. I don't know if I should condemn this game for having the worst controls of any racing game I've ever played, or praise it for being realistic, because this is what I would look like if I tried motocross racing but I'm pretty sure I crashed once every 10 seconds on some of these tracks. And in my defense, I'm being very generous in calling these tracks. Pretty sure this is just an open abandoned construction site, and we just decided to trespass on this property and set up checkpoints for a race. If it wasn't for this deformed polygonal arrow up top, I would have no idea where to go. This is the reason some of these tracks are hard to turn on. Unless you have the track memorized, you're going headfirst into generic block number 378 on the track. The paths are never clear, and you end up turning onto the middle of the stadium and you look like an asshole in front of all of your fans. And judging by their facial expressions, they are not pleased with your performance. Also, landing some of these jumps is impossible. Yeah, okay, go ahead and say it. Don't get mad at the game because you suck at it, Mike. Whatever, you all suck too. But I'm pretty sure I'm landing straight as I can half of the time, and it still causes me to crash. Maybe I am the problem, but if this isn't a proper landing, I don't know what is. I also have to question the sanity of these other razors. Sure, they may all be professionals, like Drake and Tortellini Pasta here, but the best phrase I can use to describe them is cold-blooded idiots. I mean, these racers screw me harder than Ron Jeremy screws porn stars, right? Right? That's, that's topical, right? <clears throat> Moving on. Holy shit! I, I might actually be dead here. That guy might have just actually killed me. Well, guess I'll just pick my fractured skull up off the ground and keep moving on. Like, this is just ridiculous. And when they do shit like this, I know it's not intentional. I want to break this film down right here. What on earth are these racers doing? Four racers in front of me, each going in four different directions. And this wasn't a one-time thing, because they did the same damn thing on the second lap of the race. I mean, that dude just wiped out. How? Why? The world may never know. So the racers are bad, but they're not the only thing out there trying to screw you. Yes, even the game designers are working against you. Let's watch this clip together. Everything seems to be going fine, yeah, yeah, just a normal race and what, what, off track. Wait, no, what, what? I'm right next to like 10 other racers here on the minimap I was on the track the entire time. What do you mean off track? You're the one that's off track game, not me. Even when I win, I just feel dead inside. I don't know, man. I don't think I can do this anymore. The motocross life just isn't for me. I guess you could say I'm on the wrong track. Eh? Eh? Seriously though, this game ruined my life. 